Welcome back to Judo Breakdowns, your source for judo commentary on the internet. And what I have for today is a match from the Grand Slam in Antalya uh, for 2022 in the men's under 66 division. And in white, we have Viljar Lepard from Estonia. And from in blue, we have Elios Manzi from Manzi from Italy. And let's just fast forward to the point where they're bang on. Okay, here we go. Manzi. Okay. So Villar is in the white, Elios is in the blue. All right, and pretty bent over stance from Elios there, but uh, didn't seem to bother anyone. All right, and uh, showing a bit of, of a very in and out Makikomi there from I think he probably should have just went in for that. Why did he leave it? You know, you got in. Just a little bit more. At least it will get in his brain that you will actually do it, right? And, uh, okay. Would like to see some actual attack. I mean, we're sort of mostly seeing grip fighting. Uh, at least from uh, Elios' side. We are seeing some attacks from those are... Um, most of those aren't really that threatening. Okay, same, same side grip. Okay. It's, so is he going for the same side grip? Or he doesn't care anymore. He's going for something else. Okay. The Makikomi attempt, really uh, a stretch there in terms of how credible that would be. Typically, you try to get that arm that you want to uh, roll the Makikomi into, get it tucked in and controlled. There, it was like a chicken wing, you know, it was, and backwards. It was no element of control whatsoever, so... Um, Yeah, it looks like Elios is giving some issue to uh, Viljar's uh, left arm. It's really stymieing a lot of his attacks. Now, I'd like to see that turn into attacks for Elios. That'd be great. But right now, he's just mostly been neutralizing Viljar. Okay, there is an attack there. Oh, but... Are we getting a choke? Are we getting a hold down? Oh. Oh, are we going to get... Oh, there it is. Now, I don't know what happened there. Was that a choke? I'm assuming so. Because that it was definitely not an armbar. And uh, he tapped pretty fast. So, it's got to be a choke. And what might not have been so easily seen is what was going on with his hands. If he maintained that grip around the this, this sleeve, uh, perhaps it could have been enough to choke him. Although, I... I but maybe, shoot. I, so let me know what you think in terms of was this based on a choke or was there an armbar that uh, I missed completely and uh, totally could happen. So let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, hit like. If you really enjoyed it, hit subscribe. And until next match, have a great night.